thought we were competitive throughout with the at-bats. I mean, you go down to the last thing, eighth inning, we got the go-ahead run at the plate. Ninth inning, you battle back after a tough, tough bottom of the eighth. Um, but, yeah, it's never ideal to play from behind. But Jordan settled in and gave us a good opportunity to get back in the game. At what moment did you see Jordan kind of switch it a little bit to give you those innings that you needed? Well, I mean, as soon as he went out there in the second, you know, he, he started to settle in. I mean, they it's not that he was, you know, struggling they were they were getting to him and you got to give credit where credit's due i mean they hit the ball hard um and you know they got to him in the first and he made an adjustment how good was it to uh see the team competitive as the game went along yeah it's nice to crawl back into it and you know you make them work a little bit make them get in their bullpen you never know what can happen and as i said i mean we get we get the go-ahead run to the plate um, in the top of the uh, top of the eighth there with Massey, who's already hit a few homers this weekend. So, take your chances. What was your assessment on Sky Barlow there in the eighth inning, giving up a couple of runs? Yeah, I mean, you know, had a really tough at bat with Rizzo. Uh, you know, eight nine pitch at bat for a base hit. The walk, the walk hurt. Um, after that, you know, and then, you know, kind of a fluky play, you know, after the bunt, fluky play for a couple runs there. But, yeah, it was just he got extended early, you know, with the long at-bat to, to uh, Rizzo and then the walk. I, I, re I realize this is a young team, and uh, I know you're just starting out. How frustrating is it, you know, to struggle like this? Well, it doesn't matter how old you are or how many years of experience you have or don't have. When you lose, it's frustrating, right? And these guys are competitors. We come out every day to play. We come out to give our best effort, and we put the work in. The wins and losses have obviously been very poor, and it's not acceptable. It's not good enough. It's not what we aspire to be as we move forward. But the effort's there, and that's the, the kind of thing you can be proud of. Speaking of the effort, Drew Waters had a 13 pitch at bat, then a 10 pitch at bat. How good was it just to see him see an array of pitches out there today? Yeah, he did that yesterday, too, against Cole. He had some good at-bats against Cole. I mean, Drew's an extremely talented guy. You see what he can do in flashes. It's just a matter of time for that consistency to kick in. And when, you at, when you look at a guy like Jose Quas comes in, another scoreless frame, what has, he, what has he done to be on this kind of a hot streak that he's on right now? Well, you know, I think we've, we've put Jose in some really tough spots throughout the year because he throws strikes, we, he's durable, he's come in in a lot of tough spots with runners on and key situations. When we can get him a clean inning and, and a, you know, he knows he's coming in, that's a, that's a nice thing for him every now and then because he's been a real workhorse for us.